so hello everyone and welcome to my new video so it's been really such a long time since I have filmed a video like this sitting all my last videos were kind of vlogging videos when I think twice so my mainly focus is on American popul popular culture regarding Latino people presentation and especially new YouTube stars as Rudy, Rudy Mancuso, Lele Pons and you know Radius and all their company so I don't know if you have heard of them I'm pretty sure you are because they're pretty much popular you could notice things like that that they're generally you know uh, young people doing YouTube videos with comedy you know YouTube YouTube comedy videos but with very very important background message I would say okay if you're already asking what it is you should definitely check out one of their videos and I can you know I'll write down their names and stuff but I'm pretty sure that you know what I'm talking about so my main focus focus here is not just on pure comedy videos as I said background we should I'm trying to watch and comment these videos from a much wider perspective so what they all have in common i mean at least the the main the main subject the main theme of their videos is latino background okay so this little company they're not just based on latino people there are other people like anwar and inana and i don't know like um people who are with them in these videos who are not latinos but they're still taking sometimes Latino roles. But the main characters that I'm focused today, like Rudy Mancuso or Lele Pons, they're all Latinos. And in their videos, they put very strong message about Latino population, growing population, population, I would say number one, in United States today. So basically, they do a lot of comic stuff like uh, Hispanic basketball, crossing the border and so on. And it is funny, I have to say it is, but they are mocking with perception of Latino Americans in US. Um, they build, I would say that they partly build their career on, on this Latino representation. Uh, even though Rudy, he's not Hispanic, a lot of people think he's a Mexican, actually no, he's half Brazilian, half Italian, but he's still Latino and he still fits perfectly in the con concept of Latino people. I will analyze one of his videos. So uh, two, two or three videos that I find the most interesting and maybe with the most, you know, um, with the most, how to say, fort, fort, fuerte. Um, <laughs> with the message with the most extreme message like with the really heavy message isn't these videos like hispanic basketball and and for example in that video actually the plot is that they're latinos and they want to uh play basketball with black people who are generally associated in the united states with know it all regarding basketball so black people regard them as you know you're latinos you cannot play basketball and stuff and so they're saying one you you have one minority uh group like latinos in us and other group which is marginalized as well like black people in us and they're like fighting let's say but actually they have in common both that they're marginalized group i mean still marginal marginalized groups in the uh, United States and in one second so this black people they say to Latino people like uh, shouldn't you be mowing the lawn you're probably illegal and the stuff which are most stereotypical about Latino people and Latinos say to black people shouldn't you be in jail or something it's funny I have to say his videos are hilarious so he does really good video I like his videos but he really puts emphasis on the stereotypes and on this negative connotations regarding Latino people in US and, and racist Superman and firstly there is a Latino Superman against black Superman but then when Asian Superman comes they're together against Asians so the story about immigration is all the time there and it's deeply in you know it's deeply rooted into Latino society in US. The message is clear and 
underlying content of his videos are amazing, are deeply cultural. They're really trying to to, uh, emphasize, to put an emphasis on the things that are important, that is just not a pure comedy. So he's a comedian, he's an actor, he's, I would say, an artist, but his message is strong and pretty much clear. I think that the, 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 the videos like this are a great way the be- I would say one of the best way to raise awareness of the marginalized groups in Western society in this specific context is United States. So um, he is going above the violence, above the um, speech of hate, and so on. And he is with his jokes and with his comedy, he is showing that Latino community is still not in a good position and if we see the crew like the squad which is pretty much all the time in videos of Rudy they're not all Latinos some of them are Arabic some of Middle Eastern and so on but they all play with him these roles of Latinos who are being mistreated because they all kind of make part of this marginalized groups my ethnicity is not Latino, but I'm saying that as a person who loves uh, looking deeper into cultures and understanding these aspects better. So, uh, I would definitely advise you to check out his videos and Lele's and Inanas and you know all of his company. They will be all for me. If you like the video, please put a thumbs up, rate it positively, and write down in the comments what you think about it. Bueno, gracias por ver este video. Muchos besos y abrazos desde mí. Beijo. Chao.